once again well, for the very first time to the farts and crap show where today as per usual hey it's your host Anjo here with part 53 of paper mario hope you guys are all doing well and to be honest i have not recorded anything in like a week which it's actually been more than a week, which is um, a very rare thing here on the channel. Um, I haven't really gone a week without recording in... I'm actually not sure it's ever happened before. This really reminds me of Burmesia. The music um, from Final Fantasy IX. Anyway... Um, Yeah, it's... I'm not sure I've even ever done that. With, um... Because, I mean, we've been keeping up with, like, regular uploads since the channel started. Um... So, yeah. It, it, it feels a little weird. A little bit. Oh, wow, that actually unlocked both of them. Interesting. So I think we're here in the Crystal Palace, I think is the name of the place. Um... Oh, they're the little, uh... Oh, what they call them in... Sumari World? I guess it's not quite... Eh, it's not quite the same. It's like the, the Resner uh, bosses. Um, wait, didn't I go through the top? Oh, did both of the doors... Oh, that's different. Both of the doors went to the same thing. Um, uh, gosh. Alright, I'm guessing I just need to put... One. Oh, I can't push this way. Um. Well. Can't push down either. So can you only push forward? That's weird. You can't go through here unless you solve the puzzle. Once you solve the puzzle, we'll let you through. Sorry, them's the rules. <laughs> you can't go through here- oh wait, did he already tell you that? Uh, damn it. Oh wait! Oh, I turned them around. Okay. I get it now. I get it now. Right about now. Um. Still, if I can't... Can I get them to turn this way? Oh, I can. Gotcha. Okay, I see how it works. Okay, and it is mirrored, mirrored. Okay. Gotcha. I think I know how to do a puzzle. Okay, so I need them to go straight on, which is kind of weird. They don't really... I mean, of course they play with like the 2D, 3D thing, but they don't usually like have a different cutout for like having things turn. Oh. Oh, because it's actually mirrored. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. 
So I need him to face this way. There we go. Is that like dust on the stairs? When what's going on with that? Hmm. Although, um, earlier today, actually, I saw something that kind of freaked me out because I thought I saw, like, some lint or something, like, on the carpet. Um, I was, like, folding some clothes, putting away some laundry, and, uh, I saw it move and then suddenly stop moving. I was like, oh, I got a better look, and I was like... Oh, that's a spider. Oh shit. And uh, yeah, so that was that was not a pleasant surprise. But um, so yeah, I've just been extra careful on the lookout for those buggers. But thankfully, um, we only see we only get them in the warmer months uh, around here. It's kind of freaky because apparently like it could, it depends on where you are in the world because just like every other like type of insect um like they adapt to their environment a little bit like i remember seeing this thing about like um like one of the base camps in like on mount everest and they have these like they have these spiders there that like jump super far and I was like what the hell so not only are they still around even when it's like super freaking cold they also like jump like crazy well wow, that's hmm nightmare fuel <laughs> it's uh it was definitely one of those things that stuck with me that um seen on the television Partially because, you know, it's terrifying. But yeah, um... Yeah, I hate, uh, hate getting spider bites. So I, 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 I squished it. Um... And it's like... Pretty common. Like... I don't get super sick like I used to when I get a spider bite because like it it used to really really negatively affect me um but like yeah I get them like it used to be worse like I used to get them like probably four or five times a year just like just bites um so far so good um this summer I've only got like one or two I think actually it might have just been that one time so fingers crossed really hoping really hoping um I'm just like still <laughs> like still looking around like where are those little fuckers um which like you know if, if they're peaceful you know I don't I don't give a shit like there are more peaceful like buggers and stuff if I see them like I'll, I'll get a little container and help them out and like get put them back outside you know because there's there's nothing for them in here. Like, they're gonna starve to death, basically. Um, and yeah, that's their natural environment, you know? Um, plus, it's like so much warmer out there. And like, if we have the AC on and stuff, if they just get, like, you know, like, too cold, they'll probably just die. So, um, but yeah, moths, definitely moths. I help them out. Because um, I, I have seen a couple down here where like inside and I'm just every time I see one I'm like 
I don't know why you came into the house. It wasn't a good idea. <laughs> like, here, let's help you out, but... Um... Yeah. Spiders? No. No, no, no. Like, if they're outside, whatever, that's their territory, but... If they're inside, that's my territory. Alright, so... Uh, I, I have no idea who this is. I, I think this might even be a new character like we haven't seen before, so... Um... Who comes to my palace? Uh, that's probably fine. Ice King? Mario, you finally arrived! I can't, I can't do a good one. Um, Mario, you finally... I'll just, yeah, I'll just go with the first one I made up. You finally arrived. <laughs> I knew you believe you can save the Star Spirit, but I'm afraid I won't let you. First, I shall defeat you, then I shall present Bowser with an iced Mario gift. First a gift, and then a gift. Wait, didn't we get a fire thing recently? Oh, Cooper did, but it's only for enemies on the ground, right? Um, like Healister or Spike, whatever. He does have. Yeah, he's got Spiny Surge, which is pretty good. Um, let's see what we got. Okay, we got some good items. Can I multi bounce everybody? I could. That might work out. Power Quake would only hit him. Um, yeah, let's go for a multi bounce. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Uh, let's go. Yeah, let's go with Cloud Nine. Let's do that. Summon them back. Come on, dude, that's not cool. Alright, I'm assuming getting rid of them is like the best way to go. I just realized one of them's a cube, one of them's like a. Uh, what do you call that? Like a diamond shape, but in 3D it's called. Ah, fuck. There's a name for it. Like, there's a surprising amount of names for like geometric shapes, but. Around my circles, we call that shit a D8. <laughs> Alright, anyway, um... Change members, let's go with what for now, just go for the power boost. Aha, Bianch. Uh... Turbo... Turbo charge, there we go. Yep. All right, now for the big smackaroonie. Big ol' smackaroon. The big ol' one-two. We hit him with the ping-pow pop. Damn it, that could have been better. I had it really good last time. Like, I hit a couple that were... Some of the best I've ever... No, no, definitely... I had that one, they kept going and going and going and going. It was like, it was like 20-something hits or some shit? I don't know. But yeah, it was uh, incredible. Definitely a fluke, though. Not gonna happen again. Shit. I mean, that one was pretty good, but... like eight, I think. All right, let's actually count. One, two, 
three, four, five, seven. Fucking seven, really? I mean, that was like a little late, I think. Two, three, four, six, seven. <sighs> Do better than that. It sucks, like, the Ultra Brutes changed the jump animation. That was eight. That was eight. Like, just as I was getting used to the, the difference, you know? not got a single attack off yet. Alright, let me change back to the Keelster. Ah, damn it. Cloud nine more off. Alright, that's fine, I'll just do it again. Screw it. <laughs> he just picks him up. I really hope that's going to be enough to get him, but... Yeah, attack power is back to normal. It's fine, whatever. Uh... That's pretty good. That was like 8, I think, again. Uh... Let's... Yeah! A spiny flip, sure. Again, a lot easier with the D pad. <laughs> um... I mean, I don't really need to use an item right now, so. Power bounce, I guess? Why not, right? Just in case I screw it up. I think that was like 10. That was really good. Alright, Cloud9 again. here in a sec. Mm, you know, since it is running low, I'm just going to use the healthy juice. Um, go. I'm assuming only one of them is real, so... Like, oh, I'm just getting, uh, you know, 20 health back. Like a dick. I mean, yeah, there's an obvious choke there. I'm just not, you know. <laughs> not gonna touch that one. Damage am I actually doing? 
Oh, come on, four. Well, it's three, two, and then one, 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 one. So five, and then however many ones, which usually if I get like eight, six, so 11. Damn, it's not enough. Uh, Come on, dude. What? Why? I don't know, it was like nine, I think. again um four it's awful Intuitive because he's jumping higher and higher, so you would think the timing gets later and later. But I don't think it actually does. Let's call him Spark. That's not right. Yeah, if I guess wrong, I don't know if multi bounce would even work. Yeah, I don't know. I'll just go with Spiny Surge. down jump would even work on him because it does seem like he has some kind of defense well that did not do anything so load although based on my testing before it does seem random whether it works or not Well, it just doesn't work on him. to do. Oh, come on, dude. Why am I getting like five or six like every time?
They're just like barely getting four. Okay. It's definitely like on the way down, like right after the hang time. But sometimes it like works really like just perfect and sometimes it doesn't. That was like eight. That's fine. Oh no, Mario's frozen. Do you want to be listening? Uh. Yeah. Well, because the cloud's gonna wear off. So I'll just keep looking at my Uh. Spiny flip this beach. That's dangerously close to the word bitch, isn't it? That's yeah, uh, kind of the joke. Oh, we're good. Oh, but he can't go yet. Alright. I know the feeling there, Mario. Oh, he's down. Sick. 42? The answer to the life, the universe, and everything. <laughs> uh, excellent. Okay. I'm pretty happy with 30 HP, actually. I'm gonna go with FP again. Oh, oh no, the last star spirit. King Bowser, forgive me! Yeah, better. It's kind of weird how detailed the, the snowflakes are, right? Isn't that kind of weird? Like, I mean, for an N64 game, like... You know what I mean? Like, it, it looks nice, but it's a little bit off-putting, you know? Like, it's it shouldn't be that way. It's like, I was talking about this the other day with a good friend, um, and, uh, and I was like, you know when you see something and your brain immediately, like, rejects it because it's something that is so far from the normal expectation of the world? that it's like not just off-putting but also unsettling like it, it, like you can look at it and you're just like yeah, okay that's definitely there but that's definitely not correct <laughs> you know what i mean um like like there's a, it, it was this one um like parking lot we were passing and like the entire parking lot was the exact same car. Like, it definitely wasn't a dealership, because that would have been like within the realm of normal, you know. It would, but um, it it was so outside that realm. It was just like off-putting. So like next time we were we were passing in that place, I was like intentionally not looking that way because I knew <laughs> and uh yeah and uh my friend was like uh I hate that parking lot <laughs> I was like yeah and I was intentionally not looking at it <laughs> but um yeah we hit end of chapter which is Kind of perfect timing, because we are almost at half an hour right now, actually. So, we'll finish the... Well, actually, you know what? We'll do this next time. We'll do the end of chapter thing. It's probably going to go straight into... Um... Actually, no, this is a good recap. Yeah, but sometimes it's good to start with a recap. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's been half an hour. 
You guys don't need a recap. You might tomorrow, though, so be sure to tune in for that. Um, yeah, and just to be sure, very glad I save stated like at the uh, actual point uh, last time over a week ago because I gotta tell you, um, I don't. Like, I usually use the, um, the in-game save uh, for, like, continuing and stuff like that. I usually, like, double save, and if there is, like, a save state option, I'll use that, but I'll also use the game's in-game save, you know? So, um, but yeah, that's gonna do it for today, guys. Thank you very much for being here. Greatly appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and of course, before we get going... A very special thank you and update for you guys, um, but a very special thank you to the current Farts and Crap Show members, which at the time of recording is Novellus Draconis, but if you want to be incredibly awesome, support the show a bit more directly, and get in on all those membership benefits like Novellus Draconis does, check out the join button down below, or check out our new Buy Me A Coffee page over on buymeacoffee.com. In case you guys are unfamiliar, Buy Me A Coffee is a site uh, not that different from Patreon, honestly, in like how things work and everything. Um, but yeah, it's used by I think over like 14 million creators now uh, as a way for their fan base to um, tip them or you know support them and stuff. They also offer memberships over there, so I'm basically combining the two. So whether you want to be a member here on the YouTube channel or a member over there, you'll still get on the members wall, you'll still be able to vote on the members choice polls. Uh, not here on YouTube obviously, but I will also put the polls over on the Buy Me A Coffee page. Link is down there in the description if you guys want to do that. And um... However, it's not quite the same. Like I said, it's pretty much the same perks. There are a few more by by doing the YouTube way here because you'll get the uh, you'll get the Farts and Crap Show emoji that I created. Um, you'll get the YouTube badges, and of course, you'll have the convenience of being able to use the membership tab and actually like directly voting on those polls rather than doing it over there but um yeah it's another option so it's uh, a way it's it's another way to make things easier for you guys and another option for you know it's it, it's just it's just good it just works in a lot of ways. It's it's a cool new thing, and we very much hope you guys um, enjoy it. But if you're completely happy using just the YouTube side of things, you know that's cool too. No worries. Um, but yeah, that's a new thing. So yeah, links are going to be in the description. Uh, also, if you stop by for a stream, uh, there's a uh, chat command for pulling that up as well um and of course we will also have it over on the farts and crap show twitter which link is also down there in the description so anyway that's what's new um but yeah basically with the members choice polls i'll be combining the votes from both the uh, the original post here on the YouTube channel and the Buy Me a Coffee page, and then like posting on both what the combined vote was, basically. So, um, yeah. But yeah, that's gonna pretty much do it for today, folks. I don't think there was anything else I wanted to mention. As far as updates and changes go. Oh, we also have updated our membership video. If you check out the join button as well as the perk descriptions 
to more accurately, accurately reflect the changes that have gone, that the memberships have gone through over the past, uh, like, year, I guess. Um, because, yeah, the one I had up there was a little bit meandering, a little bit out of date, and, um, this new one is just better. There, there's a few things, uh, a few things I've learned over the past year as well to get my, um, content like a tiny bit better than it used to be and that's kind of what we're aiming for here is just constantly get a little bit better you know you live you learn and then you get good <laughs> so but yeah that's pretty much uh yeah i think that's about everything so but once again guys thanks so much for being here greatly greatly appreciated and until next time take care and i hope you all have a Fantabulous, splendiferous day. Catch you later. <laughs>